Suppose we want to sort this list by date order. Now, it is conceivable that I'd want to do that because I want to see uh, who is transitioning over to this new system uh, in date order. So if I go over to the, uh, I don't even need to go to data, I can just do it from here. If I go to uh, sort and filter and sort on, well, it tells me sort on A to Z there. So if I sort on A to Z, what it does is it hasn't actually sorted on date order. It's actually sorted on A to Z order because it's treating those as text values. I actually type those in as text values. And this, again, is something that has happened to me on occasions. It happened to me last week. Somebody sent me a spreadsheet through and said, I can't sort this list uh, by date. And it was because the dates had either been typed in as text entries or they'd been pulled off some other system uh, and they were stored as text entries. Those dates are not being treated as dates. They're being treated as text strings. So let's just undo that sort. So what we need to do is we need to convert those text strings to dates. And that is done with the date value function equals date value, open brackets, I've picked date there, it's date value I want, open brackets, and the date text, which is that cell there. Close the brackets and enter. And what it does is it puts in the actual day number based on the explanation I gave you earlier. So let's just copy those down. And in each case, it's saying, take what's in the cell one to the left and convert it to a date value. And that's why we're getting the correct numbers here. And then I need to format those as dates. And you know what? The easiest thing to do would actually be to use the Format Painter. And then make the column wider. So there we go. Now, what I will do is I will copy those, paste those over the top of these by using the paste values, delete that column, and let's look at sorting again. So if I click on sort and filter, now we know it's going to work even before we don't try it. Before, because it's actually saying sort oldest to newest, so it is recognizing those as dates. And it has, it's now sorted it oldest to newest. So we can look at that and we can see who is going to be transitioned over to the new uh, system.